What is up, you guys? It's your girl Isabella Terra Tarot back at again and hit you with your what you need to know in this time reading. My readings are timeless, so when you see this, is simply when I'm meant to see it. Don't forget to hit the like button, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like the content. If you're a hater, just click the X at the right of your screen. It's really good. These are general messages, y'all. Not every message is yours. Take what you need, leave the rest, and if you need a personal, you know, hit me up. <laughs> On Etsy, Spiritual Shop, of course, um, unless I run a random promotional. You know what I mean? Anyways, so that being said, um, all the links to connect with me will be underneath this video. And if y'all wanted to join the Patreon group, we have four tiers now. Um, you know, y'all should definitely look, that, look into that. But we're going to go ahead and get in here and see what you need to know in the next week. What you can expect this week okay what can the sagittarius expect this week i wanted to start saying yep it's a party it's a party it's a party so are y'all partying sagittarius okay don't get too lit because i feel like that's the energy that y'all are in um partying yeah good times get togethers good friends good people making time for you know feel good moments is kind of what i'm getting i see a lot of you who are very focused on getting or gaining your justice or getting justice okay some of you may have been dealing with possibly somebody who i heard less credible someone who may be less credible than you had hoped okay um stacking things up i feel like there's somebody here who may have left out a little bit of the truth okay i'm getting literally there's somebody here who they may have told you how they feel to a certain extent y'all i'm gonna move the camera sorry let's be ghetto for a second uh-huh oh yeah okay so um i feel like there's somebody here who <sighs> I feel like they tried to make you believe one thing, okay? They try to make something look like they're all good, but they're less credible than they appear, okay? I feel like there's somebody here who is wanting your attention this week. Um, they're realizing, I'm getting something about you're the yin to my yang. This could be another Sagittarius, um, could possibly be a Leo, Libra, or Scorpio, okay? There's somebody here who's having... Like, getting wake-up calls. I'm seeing somebody who cannot sleep at night. It's like, I feel like this week your life may be balancing out, okay? Um, it's like letting the cards fall where they may. Like, I feel like you are kind of throwing caution to the wind. For some of you, you may have been trying to control certain dynamics um, to keep things balanced. But I feel like you kind of, look. it looks like you just have let go of the energy of caring whether they turn out a certain way or not. Like, I feel like that this is actually what was necessary for you to get your you know, best outcome for whatever this is that you put in for, okay? Releasing the need to control the situation or dynamic, okay? I feel like you may have also been trying to see who was willing to put in more time, energy, effort, and resources towards a certain cause, okay? I feel like you're making a decision this week, okay? I feel like there's somebody here who is having to get the boot, all right? Like something somebody didn't make the cut for some of y'all this is also giving me are y'all like judging competitions in this time because it kind of feels like you're over a specific competition all right um i feel like you're in a place where people may be trying to if you're the judge at whatever this is i feel like there are people who are trying to use their level of influence to kind of sway you closer to choosing someone okay um like what i'm seeing is literally like back whenever i would go and i would you know help the dance teams pick their um pick their girls who they were choosing for their teams um like the school team, like who, who should be on the team and who shouldn't be on the team, okay? I feel like you are someone who is very influential this week and people may be trying to contact you, like like pe random people contacting you out of, the, out of the blue. Oh, so you know so-and-so. People are trying to get people that they know to communicate with you to kind of get you to choose a specific individual, 
Okay, this is all about people thinking, oh, I know this person, you got this, it's good, okay? I feel like there may be some level of stress or anxiety coming in this week because it's like down to the very final, the finishing touches, having to decide who to go with, okay? This is something that may have like kept you up like late at night. Um, like this is something that's been going on for quite some time. Like this is, I'm telling you, it, it looks like the coaching where you got to keep coming back several days. Okay. To decide who, you know, makes the cut, see how they perform on Monday, then see how they perform on Wednesday. Like, like some stuff like this. Okay. Monday and Wednesday, because I randomly said that may be very important for you in the coming week. Um, I'm definitely seeing that. You're sitting in a very high place and people are going to be reaching out to you left and right. And it almost feels like your phone may be going off so much that you're kind of wishing that you didn't have this level of attention on you. Um, this is also the throwing caution to the wind. Like I feel like some, I'm not saying some people are going to be trying to kind of push their influence on you. But that, it's like they know people who know you. Okay. Um and they may be trying to, you might as well put your phone on silent this week is what it's looking like. Because you're going to have people reaching out trying to get you to get their fourth cousin, ex-baby mama, something twice removed onto the team. Okay? You're going to have random people trying to reach out to you this week, trying to get you to put them on. Okay? Trying to partner up with you. Um, but I feel like you may have two spots available and this is where um, things are, like, getting really cutthroat is what I'm seeing, all right? Um, like, I feel like the comp the people who are competing are up late, and you're sitting here, look, look out here, taking notes, all right? <laughs> taking notes, trying to see who's the best fit, okay? I feel like there may be a situation where somebody's getting switched out. Like, there's somebody here who, oh, no, oh, no. I'm seeing somebody like finding out, oh no, like this happened to me, y'all, this happened to me um, back in my day. <laughs> okay, so I'm seeing somebody here who is finding out like it's the death of a dream, okay, um, finding out that like it's like finding out that they're pregnant right after they've made this dance team or something, okay? Or it may not be a dance team, making a team or making the cut. Someone just made the cut and like they had made it and then they're finding out, I don't know, like the, it's like after you make it, then you're finding, they're finding out that they're pregnant and realizing it's the death of a dream that like they're going to keep the baby. Somebody's deciding to keep the baby this week too, y'all. There's somebody here who's deciding to keep the baby, but I'm definitely seeing, um, somebody's having, like, they're having to go with an alternate, okay? So this is like calling two people back. Some of you may be looking into the two best alternates to call back up to kind of put them side by side to kind of watch and to make a, you know, decision on who to partner with, okay? I feel like somebody, it's almost like, this is like the gossip of the town. I don't know. It's, it's getting big, though. It's getting big, though. People are talking about this. This is also why, because they're coming back around with a second audition, okay, or coming back a second time to kind of figure out who is going to take this person's spot because they can't. They can't keep doing this. Man, this is so stressful. Okay, so you're having, yeah, you're going to have to pick the two people who are being brought back up to be observed, to be watched, to be looked at this week. Okay, um, I definitely see that somebody's trying to sway you to bring <laughs> that person back that they're connected to. Okay, I feel like um, it feels like there may be some like drama around this it feels like a little bit of a nightmare because it's like I feel like you have put together like the best team or the, like the best working group or something of the sort and it's almost like everybody's in your ear again you're like I thought we finished this <laughs> that's what I'm getting okay give me one more under the uh nine of swords clarifier yeah you just ready to get out of it like I feel like you're like okay so I didn't expect it to turn out like this or something dang is it gonna focus it's the eight of cups y'all okay i feel like you're over here doing the number crunching for real um trying to it's like you know that 
you're going to crush someone's dreams. Like, I feel like there is a dream that has been crushed, but it's because of, you know, the ending to a certain cycle, needing to step out and take, you know, your next moves into something else. Um, I feel like there's somebody here who is um, having to choose. It's like having to make really big decisions. This is this is the week of having to make really big decisions and having to figure out who you who's. Oh my god, that's a little that's a little depressing. It's like whose dreams are you gonna crush? Oh my god, because there's somebody here who is like banking on this. Like they're staying up. Like I see somebody um, who is literally hit another wave of insomnia because of the anticipation okay I feel like you're trying to be really balanced and I feel like you're trying to be biased with you know the people who you're reviewing again to put in the spot it's like trying to make the best decision for all parties involved all right um yeah but I, I definitely see somebody here is like leaving a group leaving a team Okay, and I feel like there is some form of like anxiety around um, reopening this and handling it. Okay, and handling it in a fair and balanced way. Because you've got somebody um, on the side who either knows that you have a lot of influence, knows that you could push someone else in the spot because somebody just found out that they're pregnant. You know what I mean? Um, and it's like... I feel like the alternate gets the position, but I mean, now you need a new alternate, okay? Um, somebody's trying to slide in the alternate position, okay? And they're trying to push their person ahead of, you know, anybody else. Look, are they calling everybody back? I don't know. Anyways, what all do they need to know this week? What can they expect this week? Sagittarius. It looks like a week where you're pretty much in control of, you're going to have, look, you're in control, okay, or you're in a place of power this week, and you just know that there is a lot of competition around a specific topic or a specific hobby, and you are the one who is in complete and total control. It's like kind of needing to keep things from becoming chaotic, because I feel like, you know, tension is a little bit high uh, this week around a certain ruling or a certain choice that is having to be made okay I feel like you can feel it like you could cut the tension with a knife is kind of what I'm getting but it's like you have all the power so expect for um expect to be hearing a lot some of y'all are like um your gifts are amplifying in this time and it may almost feel like it's too much. Like you may be hitting a wave of insomnia this week because of some kind of new upgrade that you've just gotten. Okay. Some of y'all, it's like people may not be saying things. You're hearing the things that they're not saying. And for some of you, it may be becoming too much. It's like you're either going to, you're, you've got two choices right in front of you this week. Are you going to accept these new gifts? Or are you going to throw them away? Because I see you as kind of teetering on what you're going to do with this. Okay. What you're going to do with the newfound power that you've just received. Okay. Let's get your positive affirmation for this week. We've got Queen of Wands. How fitting. I feed my spirit. I train my body. I focus my mind. It is my time. Like, I feel, yeah, you're stepping into your power this week, okay? Um, and it's definitely being felt. It's being observed, okay? And I feel like there's something, like, if you were in any kind of energy of, like, lack or loss, I see you as shifting out of that this week. Um, and I feel like you're going to be doing it pretty quickly. But it's like having to keep your yourself level-headed, okay? Um, don't let this go to your head. There's something that you need to know not to let it go to your head because I almost feel like, um, you're going to have so many people kind of reaching. I mean, it looks like it's going to cause some form of anxiety because it looks like you're trying to get some sleep and you got your phone going off like at midnight, like ding, 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 because it's like, you got the power. You have the ability to shift this in my favor. You have the ability to do this for me. Can you do this? Like you may have to just turn your damn phone off this week. 
Sag. Anyways, that's what I'm seeing for you guys. Don't forget to like the video to encourage me to continue to make them for you guys. Anyways, like, share, subscribe. I will see you later. Bye.